those of you who are taking a class with me, I'm going to be using OneNote much like I would be using uh, the whiteboard or the chalkboard in class. So I'm going to be making notes uh, via my iPad that will be synced and shared with all of you. Now I think the best way to do this is to install the OneNote app to your phone. Okay, so once you've had this installed, and there are ways to access the same information via your browser on your phone, but I've noticed that it's a little bit difficult to navigate and uh, it's really not a, a very good experience. I, I think that if you can upload the OneNote app to your phone, I think this will help. Now, if you notice here, you've got uh, different options here along the bottom of the screen. If you select Notebooks and More Notebooks, you should have a list of available notebooks uh, that you can access, that you can open. So if you're taking uh, the academic and creative writing class, this is what it's called. This is the name of the uh, class in OneNote. And it'll take a second here to open up. And if you're taking Grammar and Context 2, it will look like this. This is the name of uh, the Grammar and Context 2 in OneNote. So once you've added this, then they should uh, appear every time that you open up the app and you can easily then access uh, the the board work. So you'll notice here you go into board wor work and you'll have different screens by date. So every day I'll create a new page within OneNote where you can access uh, this information. And it's just a little bit easier to get around uh, versus accessing the same information via the browser. Now certainly you can access the same information if you go to a desktop computer and you open up OneNote there in the browser, uh, you're going to have just a, uh, it'll be fine. You'll be able to access it very easily and be able to see all the information. But it's a little bit more cumbersome uh, using a cell phone and again I think really the only uh, reasonable way to use or access this information using a cell phone is uh, to install the app. Obviously, if you have a tablet or an iPad, you can use it, and it's a very good experience as well. Uh, you can uh, access the same information. But each day, I'll be adding content to this OneNote. For now, basically, I'll only be using it for uh, board work uh, purposes. So I hope this helps. I'm going to share this video uh, via Schoology and if you go to updates you should be able to see this uh, video and I would like if you could respond to this post to let me know if you were able to install OneNote and find the the board work information here that I'm sharing with you today.